The white, bright California sunrise. Get off my bus now! Only someone's. Let's go! Not a morning person. Fix the building now! Right, sir. From here on out, their every step will be in sync. Fix me now! And their every movement sharp. Fix the building now! That's the way it would be if these were recruits on their first day of Marine boot camp. But instead, they're teachers from the Midwest walking in their shoes, standing on the yellow footprints of every Marine who's come before them. You gotta foul it up row by row and get inside my contraband room. Do you understand that? When you stand in these footprints and then walk through those doors, you're being part of a legacy that really ties folks to who, who we are as Marines. Get up! Put your trash down now! The contraband room is where recruits leave everything that ties them to their civilian life. It's where they make their last phone call home. It's where reality sets in that there's only one way of doing things. Yes, sir! Good, he wants to move without me telling him to move. Good, I'll you take a step back now! Yes, sir! I'm out here, I say, look at me now. You know, you have some teachers looking this way and then some will look this way, but for a recruit, if I tell you to look at me now, that means get your head and eyeballs on me. You know, there's no ifs, ands, buts about it. This is where Marines are made. 17,000 recruits graduate every year, trained by tradition and forced by drill instructors. Hey, pick them up, go back to the right aye, side. Aye. Teamwork from here on out. There's no more individualism whatsoever. There's no individualism. Everybody will move as a unit. Left foot first. What foot? Left foot. The teacher becomes the student. We're gonna see if we got this. <laughs> oh, we're in. Arms locked out. Hat, left, right. So on March, you step up with the left foot. That's Kevin Gorgel from Moline High School. We can't march, we can't count, we can't, we can't do anything right. Thank God that they have a sense of humor and they have some patience with us. And our mission is to train each one of you to become a United States Marine. Still, they listen a little closer sit a little straighter, push a little harder. Jeez, this is gonna suck here in a little while. So we have two minutes to do that and it seems pretty heavy. Chris Ninehouse and Katie Brown work at Muscatine High School. One minute! They challenge themselves with the combat fitness test. A half mile sprint, ammo can lifts, Go. and a maneuver under fire obstacle course. Couldn't enlist right now. <laughs> and that's just the challenge of finding new recruits. One of our bigger challenges is getting folks that are actually capable of doing it um, from a physical standpoint um, and from a, from a mental and moral standpoint. It's why teachers are here, to wear the helmet, carry the rubber rifle, and live it for a week so they can counsel students who may be ready to really commit. They find cover in the trenches and confront the enemy. You're training with heavy equipment in unstable surfaces through the sand and jumping over things. Up, up. The fight looks and sounds real. Just a day in the life of an 18-year-old recruit. We make Marines, we win America's battles, and we return good citizens back to the country. All of you turn around now! Tomorrow, the sun will rise again over MCRD, and a new bus will pull up. And on those infamous yellow footprints will stand the next generation.